What's up guys? So the past two or so weeks I've been working on the front bumper shaving the tow hook cap and I was almost done with it. I was getting ready to just wash it and uh, dry it off, primer the entire bumper and then throw it on the car. It would have been ready for paint and as I was pressure washing it, disaster struck. Let me go ahead and play that clip for you. I, I don't see it. What? I don't see it. Well, we can't see it, but they can. Uh oh. So let me go ahead and play it. So, as you guys, <laughs> fuck you. So as you guys saw, everything completely came off. Um, I was a little bummed out, but at the same time, I was like, you know what? Shit happens. Um, it is what it is. So I, you know, I got to sanding on the entire front piece where we were shaving it, and instead of just um, having glue in there and then bonding over that, I actually plastic welded it shut completely and then um i went ahead and sanded all of that down and then i went ahead and threw a little bit of bondo down so i have a little bit of bondo back on it and i'm gonna go ahead and throw some more on and we're gonna be using a different type of bondo this time i'll be showing you guys that in just a second but let me go ahead and show you where we're at now so as you guys can see we have everything pretty much removed again uh the cap was about right here went ahead and shaved it with my plastic welder threw a little bit of bondo down Everything's looking good. I actually, um, I think it's like, I don't know where it's at. I think it's like somewhere right here as well. I plastic welded the hole for where you screw in the license plate and right here as well somewhere. So this for the most part is pretty smooth. It just needs to be a, a little bit of body, body work. And then um, after that's done, we'll go ahead and sand pretty much the whole bumper and then uh, probably reprimer everything. So it is what it is, shit happens. Also. I went ahead and did something to the car. Let me go ahead and show you guys that one real quick as well. You guys saw we went ahead and removed the vinyl off of the tail lights and that's how it looks i honestly like it much better i think i love the other look it looked really aggressive but i don't know in my opinion i think this just looks a lot cleaner overall but i do have something else planned but you guys will be seeing that in another video right, so i went ahead and picked up some new spreaders because i don't know where all mine went and then i went ahead and picked up some professional gold filler so this is much better than that last stuff i was using uh, never used it before so we're gonna give it a shot so we're gonna go ahead and clean this all up and then uh, we're gonna go ahead and pretty much just, you know, uh, bondo all of this, let it dry and get it sanded and then uh, just keep repeating that until it's next to perfect. guys I can already tell you that stuff is amazing I love it much more than the other Bondo it it's it's so smooth and I, I like it a lot but I did mess up a little bit right here um, I got enough only for this that's why this looks so good and then uh, it dried on the little spatula thing and um, the or the spreader and that's why you're seeing all those little stuff so I'll set it off mix up enough to lay the whole thing down and we'll see where we go from there and it seems like it dries really fast this is already dry so once this is dry, we'll go ahead and get it sanded, but it's already looking very good. Hey, buddy. What's up? Yeah, I know, huh? Yep. Oh, that's the good spot, huh? That's the good spot, huh? Yeah. <laughs> While this is drying, I want to give you guys an update. So these side skirts, if you guys watch that video, an update with that, I'm actually not going to be doing it myself. Reason for it, um, 
I hate fiberglass. I'm pretty sure I made that very clear in that video. And uh, I actually found somebody out in Rancho Cucamonga, so a little over an hour from me. But we're gonna make a little vacation out of it, I guess you can say. So the girl and I are gonna head up to Rancho Cucamonga, drop the car off. He's gonna go ahead and do that and paint it. So it's gonna look sick, I can't wait. And then we're gonna have a little fun up there while we're waiting. So it's gonna be a fun little trip. So that's the update with that. That's on the 8th. We're heading up there. So stay tuned guys, cause it's happening soon. See me fly and never drop down, drop down, smoking high, am I am not round, I'm not round, no denying what I got now, I got now, keep an eye out, keep it locked down, locked down, see me fly and never drop down, drop down, smoking high, am I am not round, I'm not round, no denying what I got now, I got now, keep an eye out, keep it locked down, locked down, get too strong, wanna battle with the beast, bring a few one. All right, the first coat is a very light one. So yeah, it doesn't look the greatest right now, but it's looking pretty good so far. All right, guys, so I went ahead and threw a guide coat down. Uh, sort of see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and block this now. And then I'm going to, um, after that, probably throw a little bit more um, uh, primer down. And then we'll begin wet sanding it. And I already went ahead and sanded all of this. I just have to get in, or in the inner parts now. And I will need your guys' help. Do you guys think, comment down below if you guys think I should do it, but I kind of want to cut these out. I think that'll look pretty cool, but what do you guys think? Let me know down below. Okay, but... There's so much work. I know you said you'd help me, but you got your own shit going on, so. It looks so good. Oh my god, I'm so hyped, guys. I was just telling Shane right now, I have not seen this car with a bumper on in so freaking long. It's almost been a month, and it looks so good, guys. Let me just say. Even though it's been sanded on and stuff, it still looks better than it did before I started working on it, especially with that shaved cap. And I think I made a decision up already. I'm gonna trim out those mesh thingies. I'm gonna take that out completely, but uh, so the bumper's not fully on. Actually, it's not even on at all, really. So, but let me go ahead and show you guys. Look at that. It looks so good. Oh my god, I'm hyped. Comment down below, what do you guys think? Next up, we just need those side skirts, dude, but it's coming together. It's coming back together, guys. It's taking time, but it, it's getting there. It's getting there. I think I'm also going to be ordering some new side markers. I'm not sure yet, though. But check that out, guys. It looks so good. Yeah, so it still needs a little bit of work, um, like as far as sanding and whatnot. This whole half has been sanded, as you guys can see. I just have to sand in there, and then this whole half still needs to be sanded. But it's really looking good, and I'm going to cut those out. I think it's going to look really good, but at the same time, I don't know, because when you do cut them out, you're going to have those little indents, and I don't feel like getting all you know, tedious on that and trying to body work all of that, even though I know I can do it fairly quickly, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Comment down below. Let's just do a quick little walk around. And then those tail lights back to red, looks good. Oh yeah, I love it. All right guys, so I actually ended up primering um, half the bumper, that half that I did show you that I did sand. Um, it's not fully done quite yet. It still needs to be sanded. Certain areas aren't primered because they still have to be sanded as well. And then as far as the other half, um, it needs to be completely sanded down still before a primer. And I ran out of primer anyways. 
But let me show you what I got. All right, so we went ahead, got pretty much all of this primered. Didn't do this because this still needs work. Didn't do the inner parts because that needs work. This section needs work. But for the most part, as you can see, it's looking good. Comment down below what you guys think or smash that thumbs up for your boy. I can use that. I can use a good thumbs up. What do you think, Shane? We can use a good thumbs up, huh? They should go smash that big old thumbs up. I don't know if it's as big as uh, fucking Shane's thumb, but it, it might be good enough. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I think that's where I'm going to go ahead and leave this video off. Got a lot done. Got that completely done and half the bumper primer. I'm happy. So tomorrow, I'm going to come back out, sand all of this, and then uh, actually I need to pick up another can of primer. But yeah, we'll probably do that anyway. Sand everything, get everything done, pick up a can of primer, primer it all. And then um, I really want to throw this bumper back on soon, so I want to do it before we head out to Rancho Cucamonga for the side skirts. But anyways, if you guys like the bumper, like I said, smash that thumbs up, comment down below, let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think of the tail lights as well. Do you guys like them how they were? Do you guys like them better how they are? I want to get more involved with you guys. Start commenting down below your guys' thoughts, your opinions, stuff you guys might like to see. Let's grow this channel, guys. We're 300, oh wait, 300, by the way, 2000. from 2,000 subscribers. We're growing, guys. It's unreal. And I thank you to all of you guys who have been following me through my journey. And I can only say there's so much more to come. You guys are not going to want to miss it. So much more to come with my build, my girlfriend's car, the LS400. Um, I want to start getting more people in the channel. There's some people already that you guys are going to be seeing soon. Um, there's so much more. We need to go off-roading. Shane really wants an off-roading video. Bro, you need to just come with me. If, do you guys want to see an off-roading video? If you do, comment, comment down below. And um, we'll go ahead and do that for you guys. But like I said, there's so much more, guys. So smash that subscribe button if this is your first time uh, watching my channel or if you guys are already watching my videos which I know a lot of you guys are 70 percent are watching my videos and not subscribed come on guys scroll down click that subscribe button let's get your boy to 2,000 subscribers thank you guys so much for watching really do appreciate it and uh, hope to catch y'all in the next one until next time as always As always, peace out. what? Peace out. Peace out. <laughs>